right, so we are a little way into April uh, 2024. So actually not a million miles off a year since I declared myself recovered. And um, this week uh, is the week that my partner has finally brought something nasty home and I have caught it. Um, so suffice to say, I've not been feeling my best this week, but I think I had so much anxiety around getting sick for the first time since recovery. I've been getting sick at all. Um, you know, I had a huge amount of, of, of anxiety around, but you know, the, the idea of getting sick post recovery and it potentially making everything worse. And I think in some ways I'm lucky that it has been a while since recovery and I've had time to kind of adapt into what is life like now? Can I kind of get rid of that fear that I'm going to do too much and push myself back into long COVID? Um, and I think I can't really pinpoint the moment that happened. But yeah, I stopped worrying about, am I going to backslide? Is this recovery real? Um, you know, am I going to do too much and end up back where I was? And now I know that I'm not, um, you know, I know that I'm good. Um, I trust my body. And I suppose in some ways, does that mean trusting my body that the immune system will actually work when it needs to? Um, I suppose I have to, <laughs> because what else can I do? Uh, so yeah, you know, the last few days haven't been great. I spent Sunday on the sofa feeling a bit sorry for myself. Um, and then I've just kind of taken it easy this week. So I have cancelled a few things. Um, I've managed to do most of the work that I needed to do this week. Um, you know, there were things that, you know, I could have cancelled if I'd had to. And if I'd been feeling really rubbish and not up for doing them, then I would have done. But, you know, I was actually able to function for the things that I needed to do. Um, all the admin has got abandoned. That is a next week problem. Um... There have definitely been other things that, you know, I would normally have done this week and I haven't because I'm allowed myself to be ill. Um, there's not going to be a podcast episode going out this week because I'm allowing myself to be ill. Um, you know, letting go of that idea of perfection because, you know, me from four and a half years ago pushed through everything and that didn't go well. It didn't end well in the end, did it? Otherwise I wouldn't be here. <laughs> um, but, you know, yeah, what can I do? Actually, yeah, I'm okay to do these things. I'm okay to do that. I'm okay to do that. But, you know, let's let's be sensible here. Let's not push through everything. And if I start feeling worse, then I stop. Um, so I've definitely not been out running. I've not been out cycling this week. Um, I went out for a sort of half hour outside earlier, which was really nice. I really enjoyed that. But, um, you know, I'm going to be sensible. I'm not going to throw myself back into full scale exercise straight away. I'm going to respect the fact that my body is working hard to get rid of whatever this is. And, you know, I'm going to be sensible about getting back into exercise and all of the many things I was doing before. So, yeah, it's it's not fun, but I think I'm having to resign myself to the fact that it is somewhat a fact of life that you do get sick sometimes and trusting my body is going to handle it because it works now. <laughs> um, but also supporting it in the way that I can, you know, in any way I can in order to get it to handle things better. Um, so, you know, trying to be as resilient as possible. Um, so yeah, I think, um, not my funnest week, but uh, I'm going to be okay. You know, I know I'm going to be okay. It's just going to take a few more days um, before I can properly breathe through my nose. And, you know, before I am feeling back to myself, um, which is super, super frustrating because actually at the end of last week, I was feeling fantastic. But there you go. Um, it's like it takes you down when you start to feel a bit cocky. So maybe that's what's happened. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm going to go blow my nose um, and have some dinner and get an early night. And tomorrow is a new day and it'll be great. <laughs>